Let me take you back to a time long ago. 2011. I was in kindergarten. I got bullied. Every day I would come to school and kids would laugh at me. He's no good at Celeste, they'd say. I heard he couldn't get the farewell Goldenberry after a month of grinding. He wouldn't stand a chance in the Grandmaster Lobby. Kids, stop. Why are you picking on him for playing a niche online indie platformer? He's just fat and ugly, let's pick on him for that instead. Yeah! I vowed that I would prove them all wrong. And so, I trained. I played Celeste, and I played Celeste, and I played Celeste, and finally, 500 hours later, it was time for me to fully renounce going outside and start the Grandmaster Lobby. Whoa, this is like, grandiose. Oh, sorry, 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 my, my bad, my fault, my fault, my fault, whoa. They put the average Celeste player in this game. Okay, it's time for me to start learning the tech. It shouldn't be that bad. Why is there so much? Chained Ultras. They put math in this game? Oh, so it's basically just make Madeline go fast? Okay. That's sick. Madeline is so cool. I wish girls were real. New. So Madeline is basically the Flash. I like going fast. Too fast, too fast, too fast. Oh, I don't like this anymore. I don't like it when the funny Celeste girl breaks the sound barrier. Find a button? No, I'm not a coward. I'll do it manually. Okay, maybe I'll bind a button. Yeah, I'm actually cool with that. See, guys, it, it's okay to be short. Let, let's see a 5'7 person try to squeeze through that gap, huh? Small. Oh my god. Madeline is Spider-Man? Huh? Okay, if Madeline was living in 1690 Salem, it would be all over for her, bro. Okay, can someone in the comments please tell me how to do this? I have no idea. I, I've been trying this for 10 minutes. I can't figure it out. I looked up a YouTube tutorial for it, and this guy, Indie Game Chris, did it on his fourth try with no prior experience. Huh? I, I, I might just be bad. Jump again in midair? Okay, so Madeline can fly, but she's just Superman. She's just, this is getting ridiculous at this point. Yeah. Uh, oh, no. <laughs> please, come on. Come on, please. Okay. That was a struggle. What the hell? You, you can't just throw me into this. Oh, wait. Oh, I forgot I'm the goat. That's my bad. Okay, M Madeline is Jesus? And she's a high jump Olympian? Okay, Madeline's a little too OP. Can we please nerf her in the next patch? Oh, this, this hurts my brain. Who comes up with this stuff? Oh. Oh? <laughs> Bruh. Oh, that's funny. If a moving block pushes place into you, you can jump off the spiked surface, huh? Pardon? Oh, my bad. <laughs> that's funny. It, it just keeps getting funnier. Bruh! Dude, she's actually a high jump Olympian? Okay, wait, she's actually broken. Can we actually nerf her, though? Okay, I finally finished all the tech. <laughs> And it only took me 50 minutes, <laughs> which means I beat you, Indie Game Chris. Yeah! I learned two things. A, I may have gaslighted myself into believing I'm ready for the Grandmaster Lobby. And B, I'm pretty sure Madeline is the strongest being on planet Earth. Okay, so I reckon I start with the green maps and just work my way up. L let me look for one real quick. Nope, that's not it. Oh, that's definitely not it. Oh. I'll be back for you. Oh wait, here's one. Well, here goes nothing. Wee! Wow, this is sick, and this music is great. Holy shit. She's OP!
dude, that level was so sick! Oh, dude, I'm having so much fun right now. I, I know I have to cherish this feeling because I know I'm gonna get real frustrated soon. Remember when I said I didn't like when Madeline went fast? Okay, you know what? I, I take it all back, man. I'm cool with it. Like, right now, she's like Ezra Miller, but, but without all the allegations. We I like this map. This map is good. We Oh. Okay, I'm fine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. <sighs> okay, you've got this. You've got all the muscle memory down. All you have to do is go out there and execute. Don't let the pressure get to you. You got this. Go get him. Bruh. Yes, yes, let's go. Wait, 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 I beat a Celeste Grandmaster map. This means I'm a Celeste Grandmaster now, right? Right? Please? Pretty please? Okay, sub hour first map. Not too shabby, not too shabby. I, I do sure hope this keeps up. Whoa, I could pull a chapter five Kokichi Omo with this. Okay, that satisfies my obscure reference quota for this video. Okay, first room, and I struggled with that a little bit more than I'd care to admit. Is this really the Grandmaster experience? Ah! Okay, so I've learned that even though Madeline can travel at supersonic speeds, break through blocks easily, and is pretty much an all-around Olympian, she is very clumsy and falls into spikes a lot. She was actually balanced the whole time. Maybe the real nerfs were the friends we made along the way. Jeez, did, did you see her jump? That girl can hurdle! Wait, she actually does have those Olympian genes. Dude, all that time Madeline spent climbing mountains and pumping iron is really paying off. Wait, wait, did I already- did I already make this joke? Wait, wait, I could have sworn I did, but I just can't- it's, it's just all so fuzzy. Okay, so so far I've learned A, precision maps are not my strong suit, man, this is hard. And B, I'm actually really enjoying this, I should play more precision maps. I should play Dashless Plus. Also wait, no fucking way, I'm writing this script and I just looked back at my screen and a goddamn pufferfish is blocking the way. Are you serious? I bet this map thinks it's real funny with its moving blocks and its pufferfish. MOTHER! <laughs> okay, okay, we good, we good, we good. Uh, what's over here? Oh, I'm actually okay, but thanks for the offer. Like, I'm good. I think I'll just go this way. Mm. No! Oh, come on. Oh. Uh... <laughs> Okay, we take those, man.
Oh, I see something funny. Oh, hell yeah, I was right. Okay. Uh, what is this? Okay, this level seems really awesome. Please, please, please. Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah! Uh. Please, please, please. Ah, uh, ah! Uh, no! Dude, this... This is the most stress-inducing level I've played in my entire life. Holy hell. <laughs> and, and I do mean holy hell. Because, <laughs> cause like, the lava. The, the, like, 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 holy hell. Do, do you get it? Bruh. I'm sad. Oh, dude. Dude, I'm sunk cost fallacying so hard right now. This berry is not worth this. Please, 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 please. Ah! Woo -hoo -hoo! Gaming! Oh, let's fucking. Oh my. That took me way too long. That was so optional, bro. This berry was not worth it. Wait, wait, where's the. Where's the berry? Wait, please tell me I at least get a berry for this. Bro. Wait, I just realized why this map is called Lava Layer. There's like a lot of lava and and layers. Wait, what was that? Did it? Did anyone else see that? What was that? Huh? Dude, I'm scared, man. That pufferfish made me paranoid. Hello? Okay, you know what? After spending 45 minutes trying to beat that one room, I deserve a berry. So, uh, let me just. Uh, okay. Yeah, that's cool. Let me just uh, shimmy my way through here. Yeah, okay, that's good. Let me just make my way back. Yeah, okay. Shh. Tell no one. What's up here? Okay, I'm struggling, please. What's up here? Okay, nothing. Oh, wait, there's a path up there. Wait, can I can I get there? Oh, I totally can. Oh, wait, what is this? What is this? Oh my god, cat! Yes! Oh, this is the best moment of my life. Okay, this is thumbnail material right here. This is what I imagine it looks like after a long night of hard crack.
Yo, wait. Holy. Oh, this is a top five track. Oh, this is a top five track. This is clean as hell. Oh, wait, no. This is orgasmic music, bro. Holy. Okay, that might have took me an embarrassing amount of time. Yo, okay, wait. Can we just sit here and vibe for a moment? Wait, what? Wait, how did I jump twice? Oh, uh... <laughs> Uh, yeah, that one, that one might be on me, I'll be honest. Okay, so this map is pretty much just Fractured Iridescence, but with Kevin Blocks. So basically, this map is just Fractured Iridescence, but awesome. Let's go. Dude, I fucking love this map and this music. Oh my god. When I die, this is the music that's gonna play. Huh? Huh? that entire thing how did I do that I should have died like three times there dude <laughs> what among us Okay, I think I'm starting to understand why this map is called Kevin Tech Spam Bin. Because uh, there's a lot of Kevins, there's a whole lot of Tech Spam, and these Kevin Bunny Hop Gultras belong in the trash bin. Why are there so many? And why am I so bad at them? Huh? How does that even. Okay. Hi, Editor Sam here. I ended up retrying and playing this level over and over for another 10 minutes. Why? Because I put a safe state down halfway through the level. My brain didn't process until 10 minutes later that if I did it all in one go, despite putting a safe state down, it still counts as a completion. My dumbass thought, oh, safe state, that means I did only half the level. No dipshit. Fuck you. So, uh, yeah, that's, that's my experience. Uh, while I'm here, can I ask, does this image go hard?
I think I'm just gonna stay here and vibe for a bit. No more vibing! No more! Last green map. Yay. Wow. This is the middle of the desert. There are no McDonald's anywhere. Whoa, you can flip the switches to walk on the background? That's actually so sick. Not as sick as like a Big Mac per se, but still pretty sick. Okay, this looks like a nice change of pace from the uh, fast-paced hand-killing maps I've been playing recently. Oh, uh, quick follow-up question. Is it bad that it hurts every time I move my fingers? Okay, one quick criticism that I have with this map is that in all the other GM maps so far, when I'm getting super frustrated just like ramming myself into an input over and over, I'm at least thinking to myself, okay, this music is kind of a banger though. But right now I'm listening to the music and it's just like depression, which I guess is like the core theme of Celeste, so it works out. Wait, okay, the music immediately kicked in. This is going to be one of those ones where the music progresses every room. I'm going to look like such a fool. Okay, this map is really fun and all, but the significant lack of McDonald's is really just ruining the experience for me right now. You know, all other Celeste maps have that. God, I could really go for a 4 for 4 right now. Oh. Oh. Hey. Fuck! Dude, that room took me so long. I've been listening to the same piano notes on repeat for 50 minutes. I'm positive this is what hell sounds like. No, wait. Sorry, I forgot. Hell sounds like... Saved a death. Let's fucking go. Saved another one. Fuck yeah. Never mind. Oh, huge save. Massive balls. No! Okay, that was sick, and I think it's finally time I start asking the big questions, like, why is there electricity in this desert? Electricity means there must be an electrical grid nearby, which means there must be society nearby, which means there must be a McDonald's nearby, because McDonald's are everywhere. God, I could really go for some McDonald's right now. By the way, 
in case you haven't guessed, this video is actually sponsored by McDonald's. <coughs> McDonald's. No one has ever had any rat meat in their food. You know, playing this map really made me start asking the big questions, like could Madeline star in her own Wild Western movie, and can I get sued by a multi-billion dollar company for making a joke on my 1,000 subscriber YouTube channel? You know, big questions like that. The answer to both is probably yes. I'm scared. Cave of the Crimson Sky. Emo ass title. Mmm, teaching grounds, ritual path. Okay, so we in a cult today. We that's awesome. Oh wow, that is just an entire puddle of blood. Oh. Now that I look around, there's actually there's actually blood everywhere. Um and Am I, am I gonna die? Oh, hey, Eric. He played too much Celeste. You know, I'm seeing this bloody dungeon covered in skeletons, with rubble everywhere, and it being dark and cramped, and I'm pretty sure this is just, like, the average McDonald's worker working conditions. Also, I'm nervous that this is what McDonald's has in store for me when this video comes out. Oh, thank god, a save point. Okay, we're chill, we're chill, we're chill. Well, realistically, who's joining this shitty-ass cult anyway? I mean, the decorations are lackluster. Frankly, there just aren't enough skeletons. Like, if I ran this cult, this would be way better. Speaking of which, you can join my cult by hitting that subscribe button. Hey, okay, I hate shilling, but I'm like half an hour into this video, and I've been working on it for three weeks. And I, like, have college essays. I, I really shouldn't be prioritizing this, but Uh, guys, is the sky turning red? And why is ketchup going up into the sky? I mean, not that I'm complaining, I fucking love ketchup. Speaking of which, uh, mustard people, feel free to unsubscribe. There's actually, uh, no room left in the cult. Sorry about that. What's this? Great faith you must have. Okay, Yoda. For the leap you will take- oh, I skipped it. Alright, so this seems like a big, like, game-changing decision. I should really weigh my options here. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Ah, this one's closer. Uh, what was that noise? Oh, okay, shit's, shit's getting spooky. I guess that makes sense. This is a cult map. Uh, what, what is that music? Hello? Uh... <laughs> This sounds like some Dark Souls boss music, what the hell? Oh, I should've gone the other way, man. I, I bet the other way would be fun. I bet it has, like, cupcakes and, and, and rainbows and ponies and rainbows. Guys, I'll be right back. I need to plug in my Mac. May the Crimson Sky take this offering. Please don't kill me. Okay, so the lesson to be taken away from this map is don't join any cults. But if you do join a cult, make sure to be a follower. You have more fun as a follower. But then again, you make more money as a leader. Actually, yeah, no, never mind. Do whatever you want. Oh, oh, God. Cycle Madness B side. Oh, this better not be what I think it is. Please, God, let this not be what I think it is. Please, God, let this not be what I think. No! 
Aw, jeez. We back in it for the remix. Lord, why have you forsaken me? Madeline turned on her hacked client? I mean, if this map is what I think it is, then I, I can't blame her. I would do the same thing. Haha, <laughs> I'm in hell. Okay. Dude, dude, this map is unholy. At least the music's good. This is my favorite bass game song. Okay, I don't know if you noticed this, but above me, there are dust bunny worms. Fucking dust bunny cycle chapter 3 Oshiro hotel dust bunny cycle worms. Yeah, that's it. I'm getting up my Bible. A third of the way through. Yay. Oh my, I just thought of this. If there's an Oshiro fight, I'm going to end somebody, bro. Okay, uh, I think there's a good one that also applies here. <clears throat> Whoever makes a practice of sinning is of the devil, for the devil has been sinning from the beginning. The reason the Son of God appeared was to destroy the works of the devil. John 3.8 And I really do wish the Son of God would come back, because I think he missed one. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I, I have a better one. I have a better one. <clears throat> Matthew 12, 3. Fuck you, Satan! Yeah, uh, this map is convincing me that I might be a masochist. Dude, there were way too many dust bunnies in that room. I was experiencing sensory overload every single time I went through it. At least now I can take comfort with these these washing machines. Yay. Okay, I'm gonna say it. I'm finally gonna say it. This hotel is ass! Where are the floors? Every five-star hotel I've been at has had floors. Please fix this, Oshiro. You suck. I really hope he didn't hear me. Holy shit, it's a reference to my favorite song. Oh my god, there's more? What? No! Do not deprive each other except perhaps by mutual consent and for a time so that you may devote yourselves to prayer, then come again to so that Satan does not tempt you because of your lack of self-control. Corinthians 7, 5. But I am afraid that just as Eve was deceived by the serpent's cunning, your mind may somehow be led astray from your sincere and pure devotion to Christ. Corinthians 11, 3. Then Peter said, Anais, how is it that Satan has filled your heart so that you have received the Holy Spirit and have kept your... <gasps> it's over. I hate that man. 
What? No! I'm pissed. Get me out, get me out, get me out. Yes, I hate this. Wait, stop, 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 stop. <gasps> that scared me. <laughs> Thanks for the emotional support, though, Markiplier. You bitch. You're finally awake. Okay, Skyrim. We're here. The beast is just ahead. Okay, and how much money is he going to give me? I don't want to do that. Also, fuck you. Well, let's do this. They don't call me a Grandmaster for nothing. <laughs> I am not a Celeste Grandmaster. This is foul. When did my funny Celeste game turn into Vor? No shot, I need that rock. Uh -ha. Uh, savable? Please? Uh? Wait, wait, I need to think. Peter, what are you doing, crack? What the fuck? You know what I'm really hoping to see? I'm hoping that somewhere in the sea of filth and spikes, there's just gonna be like a comically sized hot dog. Bruh, I do not know ball. I wish my organs were shaped like Celeste maps. The only thing in my belly are Legos. And more Legos. I have a problem. Peter, what are you doing? Crack. What the fuck? Okay. Oh? <laughs> Savable? Okay, that room was pretty tough, but I persevered, and I made it through, and I- HOLY SHIT! So, uh, what do you reckon this green goo is? Okay, uh, what the fuck is in a stomach? Gastric juice. Mmm, okay. I'm gonna stick with Kool-Aid. Why does the block disappear? I, at least make it fall. Come on, bro. Huh? Hello? Replay, please?
Okay, let me vent for a second. The first half of that room was some of the most fun, dopamine-inducing platforming in this entire collab. That was like peak Celeste, love that. The second half but was genuinely the most infuriating, janky, and inconsistent gaming I've ever done. Fuck that shit. Can you tell I'm gamer raging right now? Yo, let's go. As I stared at the heart of the beast, I realized that the heart of a living, breathing creature was looming over me. I asked myself the question, am I really ready to take a life? To snuff out the life of a beautiful creature just because some dipshit told me to? Was I ready to commit a heinous crime? For what? Some measly video game statistics, a little dopamine, and a chance at internet clout? Yeah. I'm gonna go back and eat that hot dog now. What the hell? Who gave Madeline a buff? I thought we all agreed that we should nerf her in the next patch. Now I'm pissed. Okay, never mind. This is kind of awesome. <laughs> My brain isn't physically large enough to handle this shit. Like, you have to be an ancient philosopher or have a PhD to even begin to try and play this map, bro. My brain isn't even large enough to understand the name of this map. How am I supposed to wrap my head around the gameplay? I didn't realize you had to have a four-digit IQ to be a Celeste Grandmaster. Okay, the only people who could have created this map are literal geniuses, but they must have been evil geniuses if they thought that Super Dash Dream Hyper Pufferfish bounces were a good idea. Pictured on the screen is what I believe the map's creator looks like. You know those mushrooms from Psychokinetic? This is what I think would happen if Madeline ate them. Oh look, Shoryuken, I guess it does make sense that the evil geniuses would put the most annoying smash move in this game. Okay, so holy shit, I think the mushrooms kicked in. <laughs> what is this? Wee. Wee. I never have or will do drugs, but this is actually what I believe doing LSD looks like. I mean, if being high has such a banger soundtrack, I I might have to start considering. Uh, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Don't do drugs, kids. Classic? Remix? Oh, no, no way. Give me the banger black tar heroin track. Okay, it's been 10 minutes, and I literally cannot figure out how to do this movement, dude. Dude, I've been trying the same thing for like 8 minutes. How do you do this? I don't understand. Fuck you. Editor Sam here. I just had to hold down after performing the Super Dash Ultra. I don't have enough PhDs for this. Okay, so my frames are dropping like crazy and I can't complete the room like this. You guys know what that means. It's time for the return of... Two Finger Cam, yeah! Let's go! Fuck, that room was awful. Was that room an allegory for how d drugs are bad? Because that room was bad? By the way, this is the frog that was propping up the camera. I love this guy. Top comment gets to name him. You know, after over an hour of listening to the penis music, this is a nice change of pace, I can't lie. I kinda miss this. The calm. The serenity. Finally, inner peace. 
What? There's more? No! Never mind. We I like this part. We okay, I didn't even mean to do it that time. That was just bad muscle memory. Okay, after completing this map, do I even have to go to college, man? Like, come on, I, I feel like my brain grew three sizes today, like like the Grinch. Just hand me my PhD now. It's amazing the turns we take, traversing our thoughts, exploring our mind, trying to find the right answer amidst endless possibilities. Could you remember them all? Probably not. Okay, it feels weird to have a normal dash now. Okay, one yellow map left. I really hope it's not that bad. We I like swimming. I like this map. That was not first room material. Did anyone else see that? That one was like a minute long. Okay, I, I think I might have gotten myself into a little bit of a pickle. These rooms are so long, I gotta commit, like, way too much to memory. Luckily, I don't mean to flex, but I'm top 10% in visual memory, so... What? 3A reference? Oop. Cool. That was a manual demo dash, by the way, I still don't have a keybind for it. Trust. Okay, another thing I've learned is that I'm really, really bad at tight feather gameplay. No, but uh, I'm serious, there's stats. Look, bottom 10%. When I saw this title, I was really hoping that, you know, it would be taken literally and we would see Madeline, like, drifting in a fucking, like, Porsche or something, like Walter White style, in that one parking lot. I think that would be sick. What's down here? Yo! Okay, okay, someone tell me which intern at Celeste Incorporated had the brilliant idea of putting a hard feather part at the end of every single level. That guy, that guy must have been on this level because he wasn't bright enough to work on Superliminary.
Parkour! What? Okay, I take it back. I'm not smart enough for this map either. I'd probably rate this an intermediate map though, kind of free. I think I've ever like pushed so many buttons so quickly, man. I think I might be top one percentile in carpal tunnel right now. Was it worth it? Yeah, probably. I may have had my fair share of Game of Rage moments, and this map may have taken me four and a half hours, and maybe my hands feel like they put inside a blender, and maybe I have a di million different assignments I need to get to, and... What was I talking about? Oh, oh yeah, fun map, fun map, fun map. Okay, yep, that's all the green and yellow maps in the Grandmaster Lobby, and it only took me way too long, like... Like, four IRL months. Um, here's a journal with, like, wildly inaccurate times, especially super liminary. Like, if you want to believe I did it in 20 minutes, cool. But I, I kept accidentally quitting without saving, so I had to just teleport back to the rooms because I'm not going to play the whole thing again. Okay, this time I mean it. I will not be doing the rest of the Grandmaster Lobby. I know I said that last time. But, but, but this time, seriously, bro, no, not this time. Like, look at this, I can't even hit this reverse wave dash. How am I supposed to do the red maps, dude? I, I'm good. But seriously, I want to thank you all for, like, the gigaton of support I've gotten on this series. Like, it's, it's genuinely been, like, unbelievable. And I'm, I'm sorry I'm not completing the lobby, and I'm sorry I haven't been uploading. I've been super busy with, like, college stuff. But now that I'm done, like, we're Gucci. I'm, I'm about to go crazy. You don't understand, the YouTube grind is real. But I've really enjoyed Celeste Strawberry Jam. Love it. If you haven't played it, play it. What are you doing, man? And anyway, uh, that's about it. Have a good one. <laughs>